So hi everybody, I made this article here about Sublime Wrapper for Sublime Text. Stay on the tab when you run it. So um, if you go in Sublime uh, Text and you uh, have Sublime Wrapper, let's go here, you see Sublime Wrapper, this is it. And um, yeah, uh, you know it is used to to use to run program from um, from a Sublime Text. You can run program with Control B, yeah, but you can also uh, see the console here in the in a window uh, in a in a Sublime Text window. So here is a program and is the the console in here. Um, so to use it, you so when you use it. Sometimes it can go. You see here, I have many files here, and um, if I run Sublime Text, sometimes it can go and highlight the the other, the next, um, uh, the next file. So or the next tab. So you, when you go back, you may be confused about um, your original, where um, on what you were working. On. So to avoid this, I find the solution. So you see that now the tab stays on here, doesn't change it when I run Control B. That is my key binding here. I want to show you my key binding for for Sublime Rapper. There is this one. You see here, this is um, okay. This is to launch Python 3.7. This is to launch. Python 3.9, you see wrapper open, and uh, in fact maybe if I do, let me see what happens if I launch control, alt mp, no I don't have, yeah, I don't have any more these Python 3.7, so I can, I can delete this, but you see here the differences between Too. All right. So um, what you have to do is explained in my in my block. So uh, this is my control plus B that goes that is goes like this into my Python three point nine file. And I can uh, can copy this and put it in my article here. And so, and what you gotta do is explain here. You get to go into Sublime Rapper, Config, Python, Main Sublime Menu. So let's find this thing. So when you go like I did, preferences, K binding, and you go like here. Press Control and O, and go back in Sublime Text. Um, I have to go Sublime Rapper. So let me go in, in packages, Sublime Rapper, and then into config. There it is config Python, and then main Sublime menu. Okay, now you get this file. You get to go um, into. Okay, where? Before external ED, so go and find external ED. You see, you will find this. Before this, you need you won't have this, and you need to install this view ID equal rep, uh, written like this into apostrophes uh, with this asterisk wrapper asterisk Python. 
and then in the comma here okay so uh, after this you get to go in sublime wrapper dot pi so uh, let me check here where is sublime wrapper dot pi it's into the Let me see where is it. Okay, sub in sublime rapper, sublime rapper the pi. So at the start here of the sublime, okay, always in packages, sublime rapper and uh, sublime rapper dot pi. There it is. Now you gotta change if view if view ed equal view ed instead so look for if view okay here you get view ed equal view ed you gotta do if view name it's uh, I got it at 419 but it's not set let's look at like, like I did so if view name because let me do if I do so it probably won't work you see here I get the tab here if I press control no now nothing happens because I must close it and so let me open a couple of files like this and another one like um, this so if I am platformer here and I run it you see that it runs a program and okay let me do it again okay if I let me put this one here okay, if I am in platformer here and I run it okay it's not doing it anymore but anyhow you get it going sublime rapper and in uh, sublime rapper dot pi search if view and do if you ed equal name equal view ed and it should and it should work you should also close it and re rerun it and so when you launch this it won't go I like these other texts here okay that's all you gotta do it to avoid this problem if you got it and see you next time